Hi my friend, today Levon Arunian and Vincent Kema, the German prodigy, played together in a uh, 5-day Grand Prix. The game was fascinating and it was in Karakon variation and it features very beautiful endgame, I was amazed and I am personally endgame lover and I'm personally not bad at endgame compared to other aspects of the game and this game has lots of lessons for you if you love uh, to improve your end games so let's go forward and see what happens and interestingly levon plays or uh, in the opening plays very simple like exchanges the pawn and simplifies opening doesn't try to gain any specific advantage just wants to take the game to the end game Let's see what happens. So now we have normal development so far, and notice that Levon uh, somehow says that take my bishop where you are knight, and I will take it back with a pawn. And Vincent waits until the right moment and finally captures that bishop. Levon has to take with the pawn, otherwise, like if you take it with a queen, is not worth it because first kicks your other bishop away then brings its bishop out and with the tempo attacks your queen you may attack the h pawn with your bishop say that okay i, I can regain the tempo but it doesn't help uh, black has a very healthy pawn structure two bishops attacking in one direction that's awesome for black also has a bishop pair yeah and it's not down any tempo so to not fall behind level one takes with the c pawn and this is a very important lesson here. You may say that uh, double pawns are bad, but uh, the point is that this pawn on d3 blocks many squares. Blocks uh, actually e4 and c4. For example, knight of mm, black never can jump in. And uh, disabling this knight is the main feature of this game. Uh, it have it uh, remains till the end of the game just watch out this night and vincent didn't take it serious at this moment vincent had to activate this night move it back but he didn't think that levon for example move it back and then levon for example goes back as well and we have a normal game here vincent had to be a little bit modest in this game but he tried to be aggressive didn't uh, underestimate uh, lack of squares for his knight. So develops queen attacking to the b2 pawn. It's a basic attack. And Levon simply answers with the knight d and uh, knight f3. Here notice that you cannot simply grab this pawn because it is poison. First attacks your queen. You should move the queen away. Then simply can grab the e pawn but can go even further. And e pawn is of course much better than that weak b pawn. It can go even much more further because first can attack the queen and then harass the rook. Rook cannot go to b8 because then bishop traps the rook. So rook has to go to ugly square of a7 and then then only then grab the e pawn. Yeah, you, so for such a reason move of uh, vincent didn't make any sense uh, so he tried to consolidate in a center and defend the e pawn but every move he makes he loses the tempo and uh, levon just uh, kicks away the queen of black and tries to double the rooks on the c file by moving away the queen so first rook joins first knight blockades the uh, blockades the c file also occupies an important square and now first Levon kicks the queen away queen goes behind the bishop and then takes the bishop and uh, vincent takes back with the knight notice that taking with the queen is just giving a tempo to Levon, just uh, allowing freely develop two rooks I mean, you cannot grab this um, pawn because yeah, you lo lost the back rank. And if you 
uh, lose more time than uh, seven strength if you lose more time then you will lose the game simply for example knight also joins there and wins the game so uh, vincent didn't capture with the queen captured with the knight and Levon went in and doubled the rooks and tripled actually finally and after a lot of exchange we arrived to this position that is a uh, position that i love to talk about it see the position black's bishop is disabled black's knight is disabled cannot get in black's rook can just uh, say in the background otherwise uh, lots of pressure can come in with the rook of uh, white also there is no open file that black rook can use so black is ascending very bad despite the fact that white has uh, double pawns on d file so black should defend the knight and uh, white attacks the pawn you may say that white give up a c open file but knight is not defended so it's the file is not given up no and black tries to bring the king in to defend the knight and then release the rook but in this time uh, white managed to bring the knight as well and attack the knight of black what can you do you should react to this move and especially when you are uh, in low in a space you should exchange pieces and this is what vincent did you may say that why well, he didn't exchange bishop doesn't change much because uh white can simply capture the knight and if you take the bishop then goes uh, and grabs some pawn and this is a complicated position a seal but a seal black is a one is the one that is much worse and b pawn is falling soon so uh doesn't change the outcome of the game much therefore vincent simply took the knight and level recaptured and finally vincent uh, goes to grab the open file but after defending its own pawn uh and uh, Levon went to a7 now this rook on um, uh, c file cannot leave the c file for example at this position if you take this pawn then it's end of a day right you lose the whole piece so even though vincent has a open file it cannot use open file and levon in this case has a very strong king can use it in best um, in, with the best in performance brings the king forward and push the pawns to break through vincent of course doesn't open file and you can see vincent just goes forward and backward with the rook levon has all the time in the world to open the files and finally at this position after levon pushes uh, f5 vincent resigns why because you cannot capture this pawn of course if you capture with the g pawn the uh, g pawn of white is too strong to be a queen so if you capture with the f pawn uh, with the e pawn is even worse because first pushes to knight you may say that your king can control this pawn but it doesn't help it's a mate here actually you cannot do much and getting mated yeah it was amazing game uh, it, it was uh, vincent was in suksong all the game at the end game and very beautiful play by Levon. How good he has seen this whole line. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.